What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to show you how to make a half tone effect. There are a couple of ways to do it and I will show you one of the ways. Basically uh, you should be using uh, blend and clipping mask effects. So just um, uh, you can do it uh, with uh, various uh, objects and I will show you with uh, circles. So you make a circle with this size and you copy it, you can copy it just uh, by dragging it with, with uh, Alt and Shift pressed on the keyboard. And this one is going to be a little bigger. So you select both of them and go to Object and Blend. You can set the blending options and you can make it uh, with uh, specified steps and you can make it with smooth color. This smooth color will make it uh, with uh, less space between them. I, I will uh, set it uh, with the specified steps, with 12 steps, 12 objects in between. And click OK, then go again, Object, Blend and Make. So you get the first part. I will just make it smaller and copy it. Clicking Ctrl C, Ctrl F, and then holding Alt, I will reverse position and move it like this. So this is the first step, then select all. Uh, you can uh, again go uh, by uh, clicking Alt and Shift and just drag it like this. And uh, you just go and uh, click uh, Ctrl D couple of times. Again you can do this like this. Move it a bit and you got that half tone effect. Well the se uh, second part is uh, you you make some objects that have this half tone effect. For example uh, we draw a circle right here. We group the effect. This is a mistake, sorry. Uh, just uh, select it and uh, press Ctrl G. And just drag it right here. Select both of them, right click and make clipping mask. So you see you got this half tone effect on a circular object. You can do this uh, with various objects you can uh, combine this effect, you can copy and uh, rotate it to get uh, different patterns. You can experiment with it, so you see uh, different kind of uh, half-tone effects. It's your imagination is the frontier, so this is, uh, this is the easiest way to make a vector half-tone. I hope uh, this was useful to you and uh, see you. Bye.